O oh, ayan po walang kukontra Mas maganda rin yung dahong gamitin Maganda pa rin talaga gamitin yung dahong Uh, this kind of poking I will use a uh, tire woods and this is the very dried coconut shell or the bagol called locally called her and in burning pie woods to be easily burned the uh, pie woods uh, I will use I am using a little plastic for burning I don't I don't use a uh, mini plastic to burn but only little a little uh, plastic uh, for practicality it is practical to use plastic than to use a uh, kerosene or the what we call the gas because uh, use uh, burning plastic is also a 
against the prevention of environment but a little bit is not uh, bad it's not so bad but uh, practical but the aid also of what we call the bonot or the coconut husk see the coconut husk the bagol or the coconut shell and firewood is easily ignited or burned because of plastic that is for practicality but the most eco-friendly uh, kerosene na uh, Uh, in, instead of kerosene is what we call here uh, locally called the pellet or the reason of pili to easily burn the wood that is the pili nut para po mabalata ng madali yung pangalawang layer ng balat ng pili pagkatapos ng kukunasyon actually hindi pangalawa kasi, kasi meron siyang first layer may si first and second and third layer ng balat ang pili kumukulong tubig so third layer na para matanggal yung second layer na balat yung tamang tama lang pagkakulo pero medyo lumala lumalambot din ng konti ang laman niyan pili po ang bilis sa kumulo oh Ayan, kumukulo na. Pero, pag natanggal na yung balat niyan, hindi pa rin pili siya lutuin. Uh, medyo hanguin rin muna yung laman at saka ibilad muna sa araw at patuyuin ng kaunti bago siya lutuin. po di ba po madali magpakulo oh. pero yung mga naririnig po ninyo mga background music ay hindi po naman yun musika ko galing po yun sa kapitbahay sana hindi po aalisin ni youtube <laughs> po kumukulo na oh. kasi yung mga kapitbahay namin maraming mga nagpapatugtog eh pag inalis ko yung sound ng music eh, pati sound naman ng tinlo, pagluloto ko eh mawawala so no choice minsan inaalis ko rin ilalagyan ko rin ang sound o yan pwede na itong hanguin para tanggalin yung second layer na sinatawag kong pangalawang balat pagkatapos na matanggal yung pinaka coconut uh, ay hindi pili nat yung pero ang totoo shell niya yung third shell layer ng, ng balat na kasi tatlo ang layer ng balat ng pili meron pa siyang balat na pangalawa aalisin uli yun pagkatapos pidyo pa kuluan ng kaunti hanggang sa yung ang kompleto talaga kulay, apat yung pinaka manipis sa panlabas din pangalawa yung isang pulp din na kinakain din yun tapos yung matigas na nabalat na di kinakain din yung tatanggalin tapos yun na ang laman <laughs> O, ayan na. Babalat na natin. Ayan na. Sige, balat na natin. Muli natin siyang lulutuin. Ang tawag sa luto na ito ay pastillas de pili. Dati pag lumulo, nagluluto kami nito talagang marami. Ito kumbaga sampul ko lang eh. Para maipakita ko kung paano gawin. Sako-sako ang pili dito pag inaano eh. <laughs> Pero homemade lang kasi ito. Kunti lang. Uh, pang dessert lang. Hindi naman pang, siguro kung magsasadya eh pwede. Pambinta na.
Pag ka nabalatan na ito lahat, uh, medyo drain ng konti yan eh. Uh, patuyuin muna sa uh, araw. Pag medyo matuyo na, pwede na, saka na siya pwede lutuin. Uh, caramelized na asukal ang paglalagyan niyan. Para maging kende. Ayan na po. Maputi na. Pwede na siya ibilad bago lutuin. Magkakaramelize po na ng asukal uh, sa kawali. Kaka doon pag medyo kumukulo-kulo na, ihahalo. Nagtutubig muli ya mga ilang beses. Titigas, magtutubig, tapos titigas uli. Paulit-ulit na process hanggang sa... At kapag tuyo na, kailang, pwede na siyang lutuin. Kailangan asukal at anis. Nakahaluin sa kawali. Doon lutuin. Uh, ito po ay anis uh, na ilalagay natin sa, sa kahit anong kindi. Maganda ang anis na uh, mabago. Oops, tika. Meron pa pala ako ibang niluloto. So, pala naman doon eh. Hindi naman tulad ng gas rinse na kailangan mo pa i-check lagi. Yung sa kahoy, eh, bawasan mo lang yung gatong, pwede na. Oo, yan po ang nabalatang uh, pili. Pwede na yan maluto o maya-maya. Oo, yan po ang nabalatang uh, pili. Pwede na yan maluto o maya-maya.
Hi, have a pleasant viewing time to all of you. With love, inspiration, and blessings of our God, the Creator, Provider, Lord and Savior, and Giver of wisdom and talents. I thank you also for watching my YouTube channel. And for giving uh, likes, comments, and for subscribing to my channel with my humble videos of gardening, tree planting, and mountaineering, strolling or traveling, with my ordinary cooking and household chores, home care, like planting, going to the beach, etc. And most especially my OPMs uploaded in YouTube. For scooping with my video for my blogs. I use two kinds of tripod for my gadgets. The first one is the wooden tripod that is made of branch of the tree. And the other one is the vintage tripod. This is originally used for camera, tripod of 1990s generation. Now I convert, converted it for gadgets tripod for my blogs, which can be used economically and practically to, than to buy a new tripod. In this video, you can hear also uh, music background of my OPM I wrote, which is entitled "Sabihin mo na, aminin mo na." I uploaded I uploaded that for YouTube three years ago, but due to some other concerns in life, I abandoned it till I forgot my password that I failed my plan to delete that music upload. But it is only the share of words pandemic time. I decided to recover my accounts. And then when I see the need to have additional amusement or leisure to avoid boredom and stress due to COVID-19. At the same time, I entertain also others while giving additional uh, with my additional amusement, with my humble tips. And time to entertain also others while giving additional uh, blogs and posts that I can share. I can do this. Uh, I see if I add and with if I continue uploading a pleasant view of place with trees, granaries like rice fields, mountains, springs, beaches lake and other natural tourist spots and resorts here in our town i like also to uphold ordinary living and ideas of countryside lifestyle which can be seen with my own example of simple living in the province the love of nature endangered species insects birds trees and creatures in the wilds and in the town like some other bloggers I'm interested to inform and to inspire, to talk and to sing, to hear and to share, to think and to tell the ideas. I like to share with care. And as a blogger, I wasn't born to have interest in music and to sing playing with my guitar. But it was only in the year when EBCBN uh, with Peep Up Himig Handog Lab Song Return when I decided to write my own OPM to join the songwriting contest. Then I discovered myself as a songwriter. But till now, my song was not yet uh, being heard on television via Peep Up, Himig Handog Love Song. By God's grace, it was through